Burning is a chemical reaction. Uh, objects burn when they uh, form chemical reactions with oxygen, often with a flame, such as the natural gas in the uh, Bunsen burner here. But uh, there are some kinds of things that we usually don't think of as flammable, things that, uh, that uh, perform this chemical reaction called burning. Metals, for example, are usually thought of as things that don't burn. They don't burn by themselves. But uh, if you get them started, some kinds of metals will burn. Uh, this is magnesium. Magnesium is a light metal, sometimes associated with the magnesium wheels and so forth on cars. But uh, magnesium is a metal, if you get it started by putting it in the flame, will actually burn quite brightly and spontaneously. Uh, so let's uh, take a look at this. When it does burn quite brightly, it emits a certain amount of ultraviolet light, which can be dangerous to your eyes. So usually when we do this, we kind of watch it get started and then kind of uh, look in some other direction while it burns. Very, very bright flame. And when we get done, after the burning has taken place, we don't have uh, magnesium metal anymore. We have a white powder, magnesium oxide, with characteristics that are quite different from magnesium metal or from oxygen, for that matter. We ordinarily don't think of uh, steel or iron as being a flammable substance. And it doesn't burn uh, very well, but if you get it started and keep nursing it with oxygen, it will, in fact, slowly kind of blow, glow and burn, forming an iron oxide compound uh, actually, a couple of different kinds of iron oxide compounds that we call rust. Like that. Well, there's actually a commercial product that uh, make, takes advantage of that. You can buy this little unit from the uh, people who sell uh, uh, Scout, uh, Boy Scout uh, equipment. It's the Boy Scout Spark Maker for starting fires. And uh, it has a little piece of metal, uh, rare earth, usually co uh, covered with oxide so that it's not spontaneously burning. And then they give you a little scraper. And the idea is, is when you scrape off that oxide and scrape off a piece of that metal, it will in fact spontaneously ignite and burn, creating the spark which uh, scouts are supposedly going to use to start fires. <laughs> You wonder about that. You wonder if uh, that's the wisest thing in the world to do, is to give uh, Cub Scouts a fire starter and send them out into the forest. Well, I've been there with those Cub Scouts, and I've tried to make a fire with these things, and I tell you, it's very, very hard. But the Cub Scouts will go and do it for hours on end. So it turns out to be a great invention. <laughs>